Hello and welcome guys. So I am starting this new sessions of videos where I'll discuss the different interview questions that might be asked during your interviews. No matter what domain you're moving into, or I would say the different type of streams, like whether you are into uh, when moving into ITs or business operations, but if you're moving into the Swift payments and if you are uh, showing as if you have Swift payment skill, then these questions might be asked and i expect these questions bare minimum to be asked because as i being an interviewer definitely ask this mix of basics plus the advanced level questions so this series will have the mixture of both uh, basics as well as the advanced level questions that might be asked during your interviews and if you really rectify that these uh, questions you are in a position to answer it then I believe that you are good to go for those positions. So the first and foremost thing that will be asked by an interviewer to you that is, could you explain? Could you explain with an example? or a scenario. Where you can source the end to end and to end. business flow of payment. So this is the basic questions that can be asked to any of a candidate who is giving an interview. So what it means is, so I'll just read out this question one more time. So could you explain with an example or a scenario where you can show us the end-to-end -end business flow of a payment? So what exactly he's looking for this is, you explain with an example, how the payment is initiated, what happens when the payment is initiated. So if I have to answer this, so as an answer, you, what you need to do is, you need to, if you have, if you are in a position where you have a pen and paper, then you start writing down those pictures, flows and everything. So, <clears throat> so if, I, if, I, if you have to answer this, what you need to do is, let's take an example. Always start with, let's take an example. Round who wants to send a payment to his friend of the GBP one thousand was chase in UK holding an account with. Stand charter. And Britain. So you need to explain by taking the scenario yourself. You have to mention all those things and then start preparing the pictures. So as in this case, you know, you'll take Ram, you'll have some account and some address.
it holds an account. Let's suppose it's BIM. These have some address. Now, by showing this, you can start explaining on, on, on each of the levels. That is, um, if, if it starts, From RAM, so a RAM, if he is using any mobile banking channel or or any online banking channel, so what happens over there, right? So those things you explain it how the main offset channel it uses to initiate the transaction and what are the values that takes place, and then uh, on receiving at SBI and bank, what it happens over SBI and what are the validations, what is the account hosting. And so many things. And what what happens at the payment gateway side, right, right? Those things you have to explain, and then you explain on the Swift part. What does the Swift validation it does, and what message is created, right? Those things you have to mention it. And then SBLGB side, what are things validation happens, and what are the account posting that happens. Those things you done and how does that uh, final credit happens and the different types of charges so one straight flow one direct payment flow if you explain it that should be more than enough and other than that if an interviewer asks you what if a multiple bank is involved in the payment how does the center correspond and other issue corresponded will take place into the action and when does those receiver and Sender correspondent will be taken on what configuration will be done. You know, so many things. So this is straight flow where you can explain it. And in order to understand in depth about this question itself and a lot more on this entire interview questions, you can enroll yourself with us by sending us an inquiry. I'll just mention over here the email ID. for different batch inquiry. Email us, that is Swift payment, P-A-Y-M-E-N-T, guru, at gmail.com. So over there, you learn a lot of things, not only this in the one interview questions, there are a lot of things, as I have already mentioned, like these are so many topics which will be discussed during this entire course. This is more than 20, 23 hours of a course, which you can utilize. And after going through this, Entire course, I'm pretty much sure that you will be able to crack any kind of interview. There is a lot of information on the business flows. So grab this opportunity and learn the each aspect of the payment, especially into the Swift payments point of view and ISO 222. So that's all from my side today and hoping to see you join a lot and lot in the training batches. We have the recorded video batches as well in order to understand that. Just watch all the other videos.
and I'll see you next time. Thank you, everyone. Stay tuned.